Hi y'all, I'm Grandma and welcome to my kitchen. Today I'm going to show you how to make an easy, simple, semi-homemade strawberry trifle. Okay, we're going to start with, I've got my trifle bowl out. And the first I want to show you, I did five cups of fresh strawberries. I cut them in quarters and then I put a half a cup of sugar in here. And then I put it in the refrigerator and for about 30 to 40 minutes I went in and I stirred them okay trying to get that sugar nice and melted and then it looks like this so back with the trifle bowl all right we're gonna start with and I use I'm going to use this is why it's in my homemade is pound cake okay I'm going to show you, I'm using the Sara Lee, which is 16 ounces, which is a pound, okay, of a pound cake. I took and I diced this up, and I'm going to layer it. I love pound cake. You can do this with uh, angel food cake, but I dearly, dearly love pound cake, so I thought, hey, let's do it with that. Now, we're going to add a few of the strawberries. I hope y'all can keep up with me because I'm kind of all over the place right now. Just add a few of them. Now, I took and I mixed up some vanilla pudding, instant vanilla pudding. Okay, let's get that out of the way for you. And I made it just like the package told me to. And with that, I'm going to take one whole thing of whipped topping. Make sure you get it nice and thawed out. Ooh, I'm making a mess. Now you want to fold that in. And this is definitely semi-homemade. Not scratched. Makes it a lot easier. And I do like very easy things at times. There we go. Just gonna get me a larger spoon. And then I'm gonna take and I'm going to layer this. Once you get a good layer on it, then go back and get you some more pound cake. And put that on top of that. And we're going to keep layering this. A few more strawberries. Pudding mix. This is going to be a, such a good dessert, and it's great for the summertime, too. Now, if you don't have fresh strawberries, you can use frozen, but if you use frozen and you thaw it out, make sure you just add the sugar. Don't worry about putting it in the refrigerator and letting the sugar dissolve. Just stir it really good until the sugar dissolves because you've already got an actual juice to it. Now, I'm going to put the remainder of 
the pound cake on. There we go. And then I'm going to put almost all the strawberries left. I want to keep a spoon just to put on top for decoration. It, I guess I was an adult the first time I tasted a strawberry that hadn't been soaked overnight in milk and sugar. It's just uh, the way I was grown up and uh, didn't know that you're supposed to eat them any other way. I love strawberries. They're absolutely delicious. Now, I'm going to put rest of the pudding mix on top. to that. I'm going to add the few strawberries that I saved. There it is. It's already made up. What do you think? I tell you what, it's going to be absolutely delicious. So there you have it. It was fast, it was easy, and it was semi-homemade. And most of all, it's delicious. Now, don't forget, push a like and subscribe to my page. And until next time, from my kitchen to yours, love and light.